All right, in this video, I'm going to be machining these awesome tubes here. And as you can see, it's a pretty cool part, especially since it uh, barely clears my uh, cross slide there on my lathe. Now these parts are made out of aluminum tubing that's pretty close to the final size of the part. So what I did is I clamped onto the tubing with some pie jaws and I skimmed the OD uh, leave-in stock and skimmed the ID and then flipped it around and clamped onto that. And that way I made sure that I wasn't clamping onto the um, rough surface of the material and deforming the part. And then I finished uh, one side on the ID complete and then I flipped it around and finished the second side on the ID and then final skims the OD uh, to bring it to size. And these also have some rounded edges on the on one side of the part where the handle is going to be. Um, I didn't show all of the turning um, on this turning section because I figured you know that takes quite a bit of time and you know you get the idea of what's going on. So now I took the uh, chuck off that I used on the lathe and put it on my uh, manual indexer on the mill and uh, that way I could use the same uh, pie jaws for holding the part in the milling operation and I had two different lengths of these parts a short one and a long one um, on the shorter parts I was able to uh, machine the part without using any supports on the other end of the part um, on the longer ones I did wind up making something that uh, supported the bottom section of the part because uh, it that way to give it a little bit more rigidity when I'm milling it and as you can see here uh, what I wind up doing was I would cut a section out and rotate it and cut a section out and rotate it that's because the part wound up with having a handle on one end so you had to cut out the excess material all the way around the part um, and then it also had a, uh, some bolt patterns in there for a uh, cross member that gets bolted in there and there's the final part and it came out looking pretty good i made a few of these for the customer and i uh, hope you enjoyed the video and take it easy